speaking of that tremendous Carolina Panthers defense, uh, we are joined by the one, the only. Man, Mr. Legend, man. Charles. Still doing it. Peanut Tillman in the house. I like that. Still yeah. doing it. <laughs> still doing it. That one caught me off guard. <laughs> I was like, came, Charles we, P. Oh, yeah. still, okay, still yeah. doing it. We came in the same yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I, I took off the jersey, put the suit on. You still got the jersey on, still balling at a high level, as we saw in the highlights. Appreciate you joining us, brother. Man, thanks for having me. Y'all two are killing it right hey, now. You know, it's I'm a trying. movement, man. Changing the, I like it. I like it, though. Congrats. Changing the game, just like y'all changing yeah, the game. Yeah, trying to. Trying like said, to. We talked off camera. It reminded me of remind me of us, our team, when we won this ring right here, man. You know what I mean? Y'all having fun. Y'all doing y'all thing. And first question, how has Cam changed? How is he, Cam Newton, your quarterback, how has he changed? How has he matured? What is he like on and off the field, man? Well, I can't speak about him last year because I didn't know him like that. Yeah. You know, being in the locker room, it's my first year with Carolina. But I, just from, I guess, if you want to say a mature standpoint, I think he's leading this team. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, I, I think we all kind of have similar personalities to Cam, the way he's having fun, the way he puts the team on his back. I mm -hmm. mean, that guy is hitting on all cylinders right mm -hmm. now. There's nothing he cannot do. That's crazy. You know, he does this for a reason because yeah. the dude is he's balling like Superman, mm -hmm. running, uh, uh, throwing, just our offensive line is doing the amazing stuff. The guy will sit back there and just and look. You know what I'm saying? Like it's he's got a great supporting cast, man. You know, I, I can't say he he's not doing it alone, but his 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 supporting cast has been amazing. A follow up, follow up. Do you think the quarterback position is going to change because of Cam Newton? Yeah, definitely. He's a trendsetter. You know, he was talking about it earlier. People don't really understand how he's doing it. He's doing it his way, the way he wants to do it. You know, he's not doing it the conventional way. He's unconventional. Everything about Cam is unconventional. Awesome. You know, from his pants to <laughs> how he plays the game. And it's all good. You know, he's been himself the whole entire time. And you got to respect that about that man. Now, we just showed your highlights. And, you know, I've, I've had a great amount of respect for this guy because I was in the NFC North for a long time. Yeah. Had tremendous battles yes. against him and that secondary. I remember when I caught my first touchdown against him. I, I was you out. crazy excited. You out. Now, I, yeah, he got me a few times with the peanut <laughs> punch. But I caught my first touchdown against him. This was like years after playing against him. And I, I thought I accomplished something because this was the guy we game planned against. Now, I say that to say this. Every week when we got ready to face you, mm -hmm. you were at the top of the board. You were that guy. So you know what it's like to have a target on you at the cornerback right. position. You're playing with a guy, Josh Norman, mm -hmm. who has a target on his back. Some may say he drew it on himself. Mm -hmm. Some may say because he's one of the best corners that he automatically gets that target. What have you seen in Josh being that you've been at the pinnacle of being the best cornerback in the game? And now some are saying that he could possibly be one of right. the best quarterbacks in the game. Right. So, again, didn't know Josh last year, but just what things I've heard, um, he's matured. Yeah. You know, he's, I think he's learning the game. And... You know, as you mature and as you get older in this league, the game kind of slows up for you. Mm. You understand how teams are trying to attack. You understand splits. You know, a three-by-one formation, uh, third and one, three-by-one formation. Uh, the guy's two yards outside the numbers. Mm. What's he running? It's number one receiver. Yeah, yeah, stutter, stutter, run that slant. Mm. You know, so I, I think he understands the game more, yeah. and it's kind of slowing down for him, and it's allowing him to react and not think and just make plays. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Now, rumors have surfaced about uh, my boy, Calvin Johnson. Yeah. You, know, you, you played in that NFC North for a long time. You faced Calvin Johnson yeah. many a times. Um, some say he could be retiring. You sent out a tweet, you know, uh, basically showing, you know, your respect, respect for Calvin and what he's done. And, and you talked about facing him. Uh, what was so difficult about going up against CJ? Ali Frazier. Mm. <laughs> Ali Frazier, man. I, I knew when we used to face each other, it was, a, it was a heavyweight bout, man. And I knew I had to bring my A game coming with him. You know, because I, when I used to watch my film, he would go out and just kill it. Mm. And I knew in order for me to go out and not get killed, <laughs> I had to bring my A game. And, and, and what he's, was your A game? How, how did you approach it differently when facing Calvin versus other receivers? I just tried to win at the line. Oh. You know, I, I really tried to win at the line so I wouldn't have to win down the field, 10, 15, 20 yards mm. down the field. I tried to win at the line. 
You know, dude is a fierce competitor, man. Fierce competitor. Um, sad to see him go if he is retiring, but at the same time, hey, man, I, I wish him nothing but the best. I mean, he's had an amazing career, yeah. amazing career. Yeah. You know, if I if I had a vote, I know I don't get a vote, but if I had a vote, <laughs> I would put my vote for him to be a first ballot hall, like a, first, uh, ballot, first ballot hall of famer. I could dig early. that. That's, that's what's up. Man. That's respect that's right there. Checking out your shirt, Wild for Uno. That's who you hear. Um, uh, representing on behalf of, talk a little bit about Wild for Uno, man. So what everybody, everybody play Uno, right? Yes. Let me oh, get this. Okay. So we're Wild for Uno. Okay. Basically, you get four, excuse me, three blank wild cards, okay. and you get to write on them what you want. Oh. So right now we got to draw until you get blue, <laughs> and then you get to pick the color. <laughs> Show everybody your hand. Okay. And then you get skipped five times. <laughs> so, so it ain't blank and you write on them. You write on them. So you playing Uno, Uno, you know what? I got my wild card. Bam. You get skipped five times. So this is a new Ooh. twist. This is a new twist to Uno. On the old game. On the oh, old game. Okay. Spice it up a little bit. I like that's, that. That's you can put, I like that, You know, man. you can put whatever. Uh, switch hands. Give me your deck. Give me your hand. All right, nice. give me that hand. I like Oh, yeah, that. Uno. I'm oh, out. Where can I where can I watch this? Can I watch this anywhere? Or YouTube, you mean? anything? Who are you gonna go buy the pack, bro? Buy it at the store. I'm just saying this to see how it go, man. It go the same way. You huh? must not know. You ain't ever played Uno. I played Uno, so it it's all the, the same, same way. It, 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 the, the game except is the exact, except the wild card. That's it. Okay. That's the only okay. twist to the okay. game. You can't this get crazy with it. Though. I can't. You can do whatever you want to do. There's no limits to this what is you, whatever change, whatever bro. you want to do to the oh, game. It's, it's on it. you. Yeah, I gotta get that. I gotta, it's whatever I, you want to do. Like, how did you get connected with Uno, bro? Like, well, you know, man, I got peoples out there, yeah. and you know, you got you know, that know I got people, people that there, I got people that know people. Okay, I could. And their it. people contacted my people. Now we peoples. <laughs> I could dig that. Well, listen, hey, we was gonna let you.